Is this vacation? Maybe. This is a vintage blow mold OJ pitcher. <laughs> sure is. <laughs> Well, we are here in Bedford, Pennsylvania. I am having a summer vacation sale on knickknacks tomorrow. Um, summer vacation is our way of combating the summer slowdown on knickknacks. So we're encouraging our sellers to bring us along on their vacations. And I need to be a part of that. So I'm taking you guys to Ohio. Is it a vacation? up for debate uh, but I'm on my way there and I have nothing to sell tomorrow <laughs> I just have a sale scheduled so here we are at Hokie G's I'm actually kind of excited it's a little bit of pressure I love pressure I thrive under pressure um, so we're gonna buy some stuff today to sell tomorrow in addition to that we have the color carnival coming up on knickknacks we have the tutti fruity train so we're gonna be doing some sourcing today for upcoming events on knickknacks it's gonna be fun um, yeah, and we're just gonna, we're gonna be on vacation. Is it a vacation? I don't know, you be the judge. Um, all right, let's go shopping, here we go. So there's definitely an art to curating a live sale, <laughs> especially when you're shopping for it all from one place. So hopefully we find a few case pieces, a few middle of the road, and maybe those lower end items that are just fun. For instance, this gum pal with the googly eyes for six dollars and fifty cents oh my god that's so fun but i'm not sure it's six dollars and fifty cents that royal copley bear with the lollipop is kind of neat it's pretty dirty uh, unfortunately it does have a chip though and it's 24. that's a bummer that's really fun i love that so there is a napkin holder with chickens for seven bucks Asked a lot if I have any chicken things, and I feel like this is a chicken thing. <laughs> Probably rides right there in the middle of the road when curating a sale. I think I'm gonna grab the chicken and stick it in my armpit. Let's see, this is toothpick holder, maybe? Japan, five bucks. This was supposed to have um, little uh, hangy balls because it's supposed to look like a cuckoo clock. That's one item down, 19 to go. What is this? This takes a gold tin with a dragon on it. What do you put in it? I guess anything you want. Looks like there was something really hot in there at one point. Maybe incense? I kind of like that. Um, is there any markings on it? No. Oh, wait. Made in Japan. I like that it's wood lined, so for three bucks we'll grab that. <laughs> Those would be fun. Everybody would be like, are you okay, Jocelyn? What are you doing? Don't ask questions. Here's some teeth. This here is a very rare white flamingo. Kind of threw me off for a minute. I was like, wait, isn't that supposed to be a pink flamingo? It is in fact a white flamingo. We're gonna leave it behind though. <laughs> <laughs> go this way. Pass the big fan. And that's fifteen dollars. That actually looks like Polish pottery. Hmm. Does that look like Polish pottery to anybody else? It's fifteen. I don't see any markings on it, but it sure does look like Polish pottery. I think I'm gonna grab that for fifteen. What is this mug back here? Bush Gardens. Thought it was a studio pottery mug, but it is not. Some blue and white. I am having a red, white, and blue themed sale at the end of the week on Friday. Friday at 6 p.m. Eastern. Hello. Aren't you handsome? Vigilance. What a great name for a kitty. $15. I think we'll take Vigilance with us. Over here, I was noticing these cute little bee skeps. There's like a whole set made in Japan. Look at these little guys. Those are adorable. 
Um, is it? What is it? I'm very confused by it, actually. What is the purpose? It just says one piece made in Japan. <laughs> what does it do? He's so sweet. I'm confused by it. This is a little shaker set. That's darling. I think we'll take that with us. So it's five bucks for the shakers. And then I think I'm also going to grab... I don't know what this is, but maybe you guys do. So we'll just grab it and figure it out later, I guess. I don't understand. Is it for incense, maybe? It says literally one piece on the box. So it is only supposed to be one piece, whatever it is. The scap is seven. Oh, he's got a broken wing. I'm going to leave that behind. But here we have another napkin holder. Ten bucks. <laughs> You know, I like rarely ever buy napkin holders and I'm gonna buy two in one day. What is that? Oh, is that a grease? What? That's wild. I've never seen one with the grease. Wow. I feel like that's important. <laughs> I don't know how important though, so I'm gonna leave it. Okay, so I have looked at these little fellas so many times and I finally have an excuse to pay up a little bit for them. We've got these two lemons in here. I know they're probably priced right around full retail, but we have the Tutti Fruity train coming up on knickknacks. And these are the embodiment of what I imagine when I think of Tutti Fruity. <laughs> Anthropomorphic lemons. Ta-da! Also, we have the ones back there, but they're also $40. And they're vegetables. They're not fruity. So we're going to leave those ones. Uh, what else do we have in here? We have the, the birds are so great. 36 and 22. Maybe I'll think about the birdies. We've got cozy kittens. Lots of cats in here. I have always loved these bugs. I like the fish. So maybe we'll get in there and get a few things out. I always love looking through the cases. The cases are like... Cases are where it's at for me, these cases. There's a few fun booths as well. That cat is about to pounce on that frog. $20, three pieces. What? Postcard frog and cat for 20 bucks. Seven fifty for that. Heck yeah, let's get into this case too. What else can we find? Ooh, Bavano, the bell. All right, I think I need to go get a key. $25 online, oh man. $10 here, oh that's nice. This freaks me out when I see <laughs> people put online prices in stores freaks me out. I'm like, oh. <laughs> this is cute. A little pole toy, 10 bucks. 40 plus online. I'm not sure what needs to happen here. Oh, it split away from the wood. That is such a fun pole toy. For 10. It's a nice display piece. I mean, I wouldn't give it to your kids to play with anymore. That was so like 1940s, maybe 30s. <laughs> Polish pottery. Ooh. Polish pottery shakers for five bucks. Patriotic shakers. How many items do we have? Just out of curiosity. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're at nine. We're closing now on 20. We might actually be able to do more than 20. Okay, 20 was that sweet spot, but I'm thinking we're gonna get we're gonna get more than 20. Hello, little fella. What is this? This is a chenille deer as is. <laughs> He's really as if He's like missing a leg. 
of like this little piece of Weller in there. I don't know if it would be worth getting out for $29.99, but I'm gonna think about it while I go and get the keys. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this isn't tutti frutti. $49.99. Pre tested patio lights. Oh my goodness, this is so good. In the original box. I feel like that's pretty amazing. <laughs> We're gonna stick that in here. I don't think I could leave that behind because that is so perfect. I think I looked at this the last time. What is this? This is a vintage blow mold OJ pitcher. Sure is. <laughs> Fourteen ninety nine. I came in here to shop for for my sale on Wednesday, and here I am. I'm like tutti frutti. I'm actually really excited about it now. This has made me excited about it. Fourteen ninety nine. He's pretty good. Seven ninety-nine. That's so tropical. I think I'm gonna grab that. It's seven ninety-nine. One glass lemon. Do eggplants count? Probably not. Grapes tonight. Four ninety nine. Grape cluster. Maybe a banana. Five ninety nine for a wooden pineapple. This is so good. Twenty nine ninety nine on the large brass cat. And then how much are the little kittens? Nine ninety nine each. I'll try to do that for resale. But if I was buying them for myself, I'd scoop those up. It's these little guys right here. That one's got a chippy on it. Um, yeah, I think I'll take those. Um, and then. Um, yes, I'm gonna take those. And then I was looking at this dog here. The little glasses. All right. $20 on that. And this little. Um, yeah, take that one for eight. Okay, got it. Okay. And then this for 40. I just skip this uh, this case. I'll come back to it uh, maybe next time. This stuff has been in there a while, so it might be there the next time. We're gonna circle this way. I feel like I've looked at this before. <laughs> maybe not. All right. Well, I brought everything up front. And dropped it off so they could start processing it. And now I've lost count of how many things I have versus how many things I need. Oh my goodness, this Jonathan Adler canister for sixteen dollars. There's two of them. They're so colorful and fun. Happy chick or chic. That could be a color carnival piece. And this tutti frutti, twelve bucks. Oh, hey, look. I feel like that's missing a lid. Yeah, no lids. That's a bummer. All right, I think I'm gonna take this with me. What else do we have down here? A lemon trivet. <laughs> that seems pretty, uh, pretty contemporary. Definitely fits with uh, one of our themes. Oh, 
strawberry thing that I left the last time. Why did I leave this again? Is there a crack? I don't remember. I think there was a crack. And a chip. It's so good though. Ten bucks. I'm gonna pick it up this time because it fits with my uh, tutti frutti theme. And it's so good. You could use it as a vase. I'm going to buy the fish. Eight dollars. I wish there was more than one. I know they use they usually came in sets, but I only see one over there. Let's see. Or he matches. I sense a theme. <laughs> I like it. I'm not sure why, but for some reason I'm feeling like I'm rushed. <laughs> I don't need to feel rushed. Feeling rushed. I feel like this is like speed, speed round. I'm gonna try to slow down a little bit. You guys are probably like, why is she going so fast? I don't know why. I don't know why I'm going so fast. $9.99. Hmm. I don't know. I feel like I'm gonna slow down. You know, I have a while. I have a while for the 2D 3D train. Um, so I'm gonna tap the brakes a little bit. We found some really fantastic stuff today. I'm so excited about those grape lights. Those were fantastic in the original box. Um, I feel like what I need to focus on is my summer vacation sale where I can sell anything and everything as long as I'm on a vacation. Is this vacation? Maybe. <laughs> I feel like this is kind of work, but it's fun work. Oh my god, I thought those were going to be... <gasps> I thought those were going to be plastic and they're glass. How amazing are those? You can tell me in the comments. The contrast of the yellow and the black is the best thing I've seen. I was going to say all day, but it's not really the best thing I've seen all day. I've seen some cool stuff today. Those are so good. I thought they were going to be plastic. Those are slag glass. These are coming with me, for sure. I think this is the booth where I got the green Viking candy dish out of the last time. And that was pretty exciting. I think I spoke too soon. <laughs> Those trivets. Those are so fun. That is so good. Made in Japan. Alright, we're sticking it in there. I'm not really sure what's happening with this mouse, but I feel like investigation is needed. What is this? <laughs> it's a mouse switch. That's kind of cool. Alright, what else do we have over here? Oh. White mug of $3.99. I love mugs like that with the coasters attached. Happy days. I've had that coaster set before. There's like a whole series. Okay, I've been drawn into this booth by this. <laughs> At one point, really wanted one of these. These stackable um, canisters. They have $25 on it. These typically go for like 50, 65 bucks. So it's a little bit tempting. <laughs> I'm thinking maybe I want it. But then I look down and I spotted this. This whole set, $100. And that Lox Pottery set. It does look like there's some damage in there though. I'm just like really digging this coffee pot. That is outstanding. <laughs> it's kind of like tucked under here too. That's pretty outstanding, but also, hmm, I don't know if I want to mess with it. I think I might take the tacos for the color train though. <laughs> I'm going with warm colors. Nothing says warm colors like a yellow taco truck. Boom. Salt and pepper. Oh, those are so fun. Ooh. Ooh, you see that catch? That was a good catch. On fleek. Oh my gosh. This is so good. 
It's got watermelons on the back. Ohio art. I walked away from the lunchbox. I hope I don't regret it. We're gonna go check out this end of the store and then we're gonna get out of here. Cup and saucer. Yellow, 6.50. That's pretty right. That is so cute. I like this. Carly Quinn Designs. Hand glazed tiles, Tucson, Arizona. That's pretty with the flower. Bangles and stuff in there. Paris, Germany. This is really pretty. Mustache cup. That's so ornate. Looks like the gold may have been touched up though, and there is a chip on it. So this booth here is 25% off. Might be worth poking around. It's a neat looking two set. I wonder if that's got age to it or if it's just made to look old. Person's very um thick. Royal Vienna. I feel like that's a more contemporary set. What is this? $24.99. It's crackle glass. Seems kind of fancy. I don't know what its purpose is though. Console bowl. <laughs> it's definitely not the colorful vibe we've been channeling. But I might grab that. I cannot believe I almost missed this spoof. <laughs> yeah, I would have been kicking myself the whole way to Ohio if I missed this spoof. $14.99. I bet you that would glow. I just wish I had a black light to test it, which I don't. We're gonna take that with us. All right, so my total spend was about 400 and something dollars. I'm gonna put it up here for you guys. I feel like I, feel like I got about 20 items to sell for my summer vacation sale. Is it a vacation? Mm, probably not. But I have about 20 items, so I think I'll do all right. I'm excited. I'm gonna probably sit outside. It'll be a whole event. Um, and I'm excited for it. I'm excited to bring you guys along with me to Ohio um, and just kind of veg and hang out and sell some stuff. So hopefully you can join me and uh, I guess I'll see all of you guys tomorrow. So long. knickknacks.net where you can browse over 58,000 listings. Check out multi-day auctions or live sales now featuring air plants, Mexican pottery, antique collectibles, ooh, it glows, vinyl records, hand-blown glass, and furs. Find what you're looking for on knickknacks.net.